So I went and bent this little crack back down here. Kind of hard to see it. But I went from the inside and just pushed it in a little bit so it's not such a big gap. We're going to get a new case and a gasket sometime this summer. But for now, just to get this thing up and going, we're going to use the farmer's TIG welder. Throw a little bead of JB weld on it. Make our own gasket at our TV. So just do kind of a quick time lapse, just like the tear down. Throw the GB weld on it, and then we'll go out to the shed, start bolting stuff back together, trying to bend the foot peg mounts and bend the rear brake out of the way, and just see if we can get this thing back to riding for now. And then later on in the summer, we'll spend some money and get it all fixed up properly. So let's get her done. and bashing done got this thing bent down a little more so you can see my nice pretty JB weld there the peg mount was hitting right where the JB weld is obviously because that's where the hole came from so I just smashed and bent it till I got just enough of a gap which I think is actually just about the same as I had from the factory so we got it's a good plate the aluminum cradle and the pegs on mounted they're they're there and they should be good so i'm going to work on the back brake now i lost uh the cotter pin to go through here so i've got some little uh quick clip deals to throw throw through it if they work so i'll set you guys back up see if we can piece the rest of this thing back together and uh maybe have it stand up on its own again Alright, my ass is probably in the way for that, but what I'm trying to do is get this rear brake lever straightened out. It's kind of hard to see on camera, but it's all twisted up. All the spikes are twisted up towards the case. 
So I'm trying to get that thing twisted down out of the way. See any oil dripping out yet? I'll let it run for a minute here. Then I'll drain the oil out and change it just to make sure I get any crap that might be in there out. I gotta move the bars back a little bit. When I wiped out, it pushed them forward pretty hard. But I'd say this thing's just about ready to ride again. I'm pretty damn happy with that. Another couple of days here, we'll go out for a ride and uh, test our little Jimmy Rig mods, or Jimmy Rig repairs, I should say. But that's it for today. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video, comment, and subscribe to the channel for lots more. Thanks, guys. Have a good one.